the recommended ball speed um, is representative of a fast bowler in international professional cricket. Um, once the ball has left the hand, travelled through the air, hit the wicket and bounced up to the batsman. So the ball will have lost the speed during that time. And the current recommendation is high 60s in the miles per hour category, um, which the consensus at the moment seems to be that that is representative of um, typically what, a, what, a, what a, an impact like this would be. Um, and therefore that's what the helmet has to withstand. The ball impact velocity has been calculated for the elite game uh, on the back of analysis and discussions with colleagues that are very close at that elite level to the game with also with reference to footage and general experience in this area. So there are a number of ways, a number of considerations that have been made. We've looked at the way in which the ball will slow down through air resistance as it travels through the air and obviously every single pitch that is played on is different so it's impossible to come up with a definitive number that says uh, each ball will slow down by a certain amount or certain percentage. Um, so this is based on a series of studies that have been published in literature by other academics, um, some experiences that various individuals on the committee have had and this is where we've arrived at this consensus at the moment.